Hey, glad you could make it. Mm, sorry, I can't be too long. My lunch is almost over. It's okay, I'll take what I can get. Damn right you will. <laughs> so, what's new? Uh, well, I was supposed to go camping with Ethan and my buddy Daniel, but the rain ruined those plans. Yeah, I got caught up in that too. We just hung out at my place, which was not quite as exciting, but it was nice to spend some time with the guys. Aww, did you have a little slumber party? What? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> I'm really glad that I ran into you that day in the alley. I know I have my list, and I'm really close to finishing it, but meeting you this year, and after all this time, it feels like we haven't missed a beat. I'd be crazy to ignore that, and I missed my chance once. I don't want to miss it again. to Calgary in November. Oh. But it's... No, it, it's cool. I, you know, I get it. It's cool. No, right? it, it's not like that. You snooze, you lose. I get it. Will you just wait for a minute? I should... I should probably get going. Joshua, come on. Bailey, your break's almost over. I don't want you to be late for work, so I'll... I'll see you around. Joshua, just stop. Is that her? No. Bailey? Just gonna let it ring? Why don't you talk to her? I know when the universe is giving me a sign, okay? When the time is right for me to be with someone, I will know. Until then, the list is lost, so let's just Focus on the task at hand. What is taking her so long? Because I must have left an hour ago. She said she would call when she had something. It's her. <sighs> Fuck. Maybe it's good news. Hey. All right, what the fuck? Ethan? Are they watching porn? What are you doing here? What the fuck is this? Can I talk to you? Alone? What are you doing here? Me. I'm not the one who's taking Sex and the City a little too far. Is this what you've been doing while you've been sneaking out this whole time? <laughs> I'm sorry, sneaking out? Come on. Okay, you've been making all these weird excuses lying about where you're going and the trench coat? I, I lied to you about where I'm going? You tell me you're going to buy pants every time you hang out with your asshole friend. Because you give me such a hard time about it. I'd like to be able to go out every now and then and drink a beer or play some video games with my friends and not be nagged about my choice in them. And so I'm away from you too. You don't see me kicking Joshua's door in. What I'm doing isn't weird. I'm doing it for you. What? Oh, come on. You haven't touched me in months. The girls and I, we do this to feel sexy again. 
We talk about what we should do with our men to make them want us again. I haven't touched you because I thought you were cheating on me. I thought I was cheating on you? Well, I mean, you stopped having your book club over. You were being so secretive about where you were going. You moved the book club? Because you hid in the washroom the whole time. All of my friends think you're constipated. I knew you hated it, so. Oh my god. I'm sorry. I was watching our marriage become the cliche loveless chore you always hear about. I didn't want that to happen. It won't, okay? I love you. And we just lost our way for a bit. From now on, we tell the truth. We talk. And for the love of God, just tell me when you want to hang out with Joshua. We can't afford any more pants. <laughs> You know, he's not the asshole you think he is. This entire time, not once did he ever think you were cheating on me, so you've got to give him another chance, okay? Oh God, I wish we were at home right now. Why? Why do we have to be home? Gonna, I'm gonna see if they're doing all right. Get out, dude! Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Don't look! Shall we? <laughs> what? <laughs> Nothing. No, it's good. It's like the anti slut costume. Exactly. It's adorable. I'm adorable. Uh, where are you supposed to be? The time traveler? Of course. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm sorry, I just felt like since neither of us remember our first kiss. I'm, I'm sorry, our first what? When we were drunk in the summer, we kissed. And you knew, and didn't think to tell me? I didn't think it meant anything. That's all I can think about now. We had a deal, remember? N no bullshit. I know, I know. The more I spend time with you, the more I think you're good for me. That's great, I, I mean, that's why we're friends, Joshua. We kissed. That means something. 
there. We kissed, and it meant nothing. One drunken kiss that I don't even remember, and I haven't fallen under your spell of whimsy and love. I didn't want to have feelings for you, okay? But Bailey is leaving, and I figured that made you the right choice. Oh, that's so sweet. So I'm your consolation prize. That's not what I meant. It's exactly what you meant, Joshua. You didn't get what you wanted, so you thought you'd just take what you had left. What the fuck does that even mean? It means that you are so full of shit. You give me this whole sob story about how you feel like you're second best, but that's how you treat everybody. You've got it all backwards, Joshua. Nobody is good enough for you. You think you deserve more than what anybody can give you. You have friends that love you and who support all of your insane fucking bullshit and listen to your constant complaining. And yeah, we do that because we care about you, but it's not enough for you, is it? Because you don't have somebody giving you this perfect love that you've created, that you think you deserve because you had your heart broken a few times. Well, guess what? Everybody's had their heart broken. That's the risk you take. I haven't been with anybody in years because it's not a risk I'm willing to take. But that was my choice and I made it because of this, because of what you proved to me today. That if you give a damn about somebody, they're just gonna disappoint you. So I made a mistake. Fuck me, right? We had a deal. You made a promise to me and you broke it. You know what? I shouldn't be surprised. You can't even keep a commitment to yourself. Commitment? From the girl who changes her hair every fucking month. Are you really comparing hair dye to actual people? Don't call me. Don't text me. We're done. Hemingway once said, go fuck yourself, Charlene. You know what, Joshua? I really hope you get your shit together because I think you're too much of a nice guy to be this much of an asshole. Everyone's got long streams getting tired. Take the boat in the bay, lose the anchor. Drift off to Nantucket, sand in our pockets, what I hold. Buried in the deep, deep Buried in the deep, deep Buried in the deep, deep Everybody wants freedom One by one A march to the sun Birds of a feather Die together it's easy to survive without each other. What I am 